For the latest news and updates on the Marvel Cinematic Universe movies, go to hibernericyt.com. Hey guys, it's going? Josh here, and we're continuing our Black Panther coverage here today. If you did not get a chance to check out CJ's teaser trailer breakdown for Black Panther, please do so. And without further ado, let's get into the meat of this video. So we're talking about Eric Killmonger versus T'Challa, you know, played by Michael B. Jordan and Chadwick Boseman, respectively. So they actually have a very interesting conflict in this movie. We made a video about Killmonger's origin, so I'm not going to go too into it. But basically, the crux of it is a very personal revenge sort of plot. And Killmonger wants to overthrow T'Challa's rule of Wakanda. And I feel like what might happen here is it looks like a part of the trailer, Killmonger is brought to trial in Wakanda. Now, obviously T'Challa is the king at this point, which brings a very interesting you know, moment up. Because in Civil War, T'Challa said something that basically indicated the king of Wakanda is usually not also the Black Panther at the same time. While the comics do differ in that regard, it looks like the movies are saying that usually they're not one and the same. So T'Challa is very unique in that situation. I feel like Killmonger using that might invoke something where basically he will challenge T'Challa to some sort of combat trial. Because in the Black Panther comics, at least as far as I remember at least, the Black Panthers are decided by the challenger challenging the current Black Panther and once that Black Panther is defeated by the challenger, the challenger gets the heart-shaped herb and becomes the successor of the Black Panther mantle. So what I'm guessing might happen is Killmonger knowing this will challenge T'Challa to a fight, which is also, it would explain why the fight seemingly is in a very controlled setting. I mean, Forrest Whitaker's character is there, who's kind of like an advisor to T'Challa. It's not one of those random fights that you usually see happen between a protagonist and antagonist. It definitely seems like a very much more ritualistic, traditional kind of fight, as if it's ceremonial to a certain degree. So I want to hear you guys' thoughts. What do you guys think is going on in this fight? Do you think that this is basically a random fight scene? Do you think it is a controlled fight scene, like kind of like a ritual or ceremonial kind of fight that's maybe Killmonger challenging T'Challa's mantle as Black Panther? or I guess his ability to perform his duties as a Black Panther, because T'Challa is now also the king, which is, like, I'm very interested in seeing how they play that. They could go really, like, they could balance it really well for the plot, or they can just totally get overwhelmed by it, and it could just suffocate the whole thing. So really curious to see how they do this. Uh, comment below your guys' thoughts. What are you excited for with this movie between Killmonger and T'Challa? I'll see you guys later.